Welcome back, folks. Welp, here we are. Back for Zomboid again. So last time we learned that I'm uh, not experienced enough to really do challenges at this particular moment in time. Maybe if they're like self-imposed challenges, but not like the challenges that are like listed under challenges here, you know? Especially not the a really bad day one. Um, the other one, which was uh, Kingsmith, I could probably do, right? Like, we were doing fine on it, but I don't know. Something about it just seems boring to me. It's like, it's just another place, right? Just a, a little island, right? And once we get, you know, crops and the uh, water up and running, we could essentially just have a full run of the island. And the island's not even that big. We can, like, run around it in, like, a day or two. Um, so, we're going back to sandbox mode for now. So I continue to learn the game. And I think we'll go to um, Valley Station, wherever that is. Let's see. Growing community on the outskirts of Louisville. Huh, maybe not then. I don't want to be up near there. We have West Point, Riverside. Where did we spawn last time? Was it, uh... It wasn't Riverside, it was Rosewood, right? The Penitentiary. So the new locations we have are... Valley Station, Alice Lake, and then Dixie. A smaller trailer park located between Maldrew and West Point. Okay. So I think what we want to do is I have some goals. And let me just do new survival for the name there just was not random numbers all right <clears throat> so let's go ahead and we will uh let's not do insane let's do like very high all right day length hour start month let's go with uh may starting uh day let's go one starting hours and seven just so we have more daylight on our first day world. So let's just do this stuff. Uh, rotten food removal. How many days game? How many in-game days before rotten food is removed from the map? Um, go with 14 days? Loot respawn? Hmm. Let's leave none for now. If we start getting to the... Uh, Point that we need it, we can do that. 24 hour removal for items. I mean, since the apocalypse is zero, darkness during night, we want it to be brighter out for you guys to see. Initial gas amount, how much in gas stations? We'll just do high. Light bulb lifespan, we're just gonna put zero because replacing those are annoying. Fire spread is on. Nature. Okay. Okay. Let's lower the compost time to about a week. Okay, seems good. Synergistic AI, we'll just go ahead and uh, leave those. The metadata. Generator spawn, general fuel composition. Or consumption. Time before corpse removal. Long before corpse disappears. That's fine. Corpse maggot spawns. I'm just gonna turn that off just so we don't have extra stuff that's like you know being created. Uh, loot rarity. Everything's gonna be rare here. 
character, XP multiplier, let's go with five. Um, multiple weapon hit, yes. Enable poisoning, sure. Rear vulnerability is high, closing degradation is normal, bone fracture can happen, injury severity, normal, normal, normal. Starter kit, why not? Let's just start with the starter kit for whatever reason. Three stat points is gonna be zero. In-game map, okay. Uh, vehicles. Recent survivor vehicles. Okay. On the attraction car spawn rate. Is it always low by default? I feel like we find a lot of cars considering that. We should probably have a normal chance for gas. And it should be like a, a fairly normal chance for them to have an initial gas amount. Like I said, normally because when you're, you know, maybe when you have a car, it has gas in it, right? Um, car alarm frequency, rare, player damage from crash, yes, siren shot hours, whatever, player damage hit by car, that's fine. General condition, we're also going to put it normal, because I feel like people aren't going to be driving around beaters all the time, right? Zombie lore, we're of course going to edit this a little bit. We cannot fence lunge. Um, we're not going to have them do that. So at, the, at one point, I, I want this to happen, like damage construction, but I only want it to be like doors and stuff, not like walls. But I know they're going to be able to destroy walls. It was kind of annoying, right? I guess I'll just leave that checked for now because we can change it later. Um, all this seems fine. Transmission is going to be none. No transmission. It's just if I die, I die. Because everyone's infected. Does everyone's infected mean like... I think everyone's infected means that everyone, like when they die, will have... Why is that at three? Oh yeah, because I said it higher, didn't I? Population multiplier, three. Okay. Peak population multiplier, just the desired population on the peak day. Population start. Let's do zero point for now. Fine. Let's leave it at one. We're not... We're not newbies up in this motherfucker now, right? Respawn hours are going to be zero. Okay. Rally group size, it can be a thousand. Travel distance will raise that baby up. Everything else will kind of be alone. So does this multiplier multiply that multiplier even further? Hmm. We'll just leave it there. Become desensitized, that's fine. Common sense, that's fine. Skill, percentage recovery, that's fine. Inscribe XP earned from those. Recover passive skills. Uh, journal XP used when read. Let's go ahead and speed these up to 25, though, for transcribing and reading the books, just in case we do die. Um, expanded helicopter events, jets, news, military, stuff like that. FEMA aid drops. Okay. Air raid transition. Choose true if you want the air raid event to signal a shift from less challenging early gameplay to more hostile environment. Sure. Wait game events only. When continue scheduling forever is toggled on, it makes the schedule only use late game events. Events will still progress through stages. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Um... 
Eight bags equipped. Hmm. Eight bags equipped. Faster transfer rate, we're just gonna leave that alone. Um, key respawn areas. Spawn point timer, the time which it takes to set spawn point at TV. Oh, we can set our spawn point at a TV? Okay, weird. Uh, maintenance improves repair. Okay. And then maximum distance, minimum distance for zombies for the RV interior. Zombies, uh, this distance or closer to the player will prevent them from entering a vehicle. Okay. And vanilla firearms expanded. Perfect. Let's go with that. Uh, now, what do we want to be? We're already 10 minutes into the video and we've not done like jack shit. <laughs> All right. So. Hmm. Farming is easy to level up, so it's not even, like, important to, uh, do anything with there. Park Ranger seems really good. I think let's just be unemployed and we'll just, uh, allocate stats. As we need to. Um, we're not choosing illiterate because we want to be able to read books. We will get schizophrenic, though. So. Let's get slow healer. Let's get Restless Sleeper. Let's get... Fear of Blood. Smoker. Prone to Illness. Um, weak Stomach. Short-Sighted. Okay. Now then. Got Cat's Eye. Um, let's get... Where is Fast Learner? There we go. Because why would I not want that, right? Let's get Strong, because this one is just hard to pass up. Let's get Thick Skinned, because that helps quite a bit in terms of staying alive. Organized will help me carry more stuff. What else do I want here? What else is up here? Do we have uh, Fast Reader... Let's get Dexterous. Let's get... Graceful, Inconspicuous. That leaves us with three points. So let's... I kind of want Sunday Driver, but I kind of also don't. You know? I hate having, like, an odd number. Uh. Mm. Now I'm just going to waste a point. Let's get wakeful. Ah, what a shame. What a shame. Take the schizo. Let's go. All right. <clears throat> Let's randomize. Susano, wit, bite, wit, whatever. Good enough for me. Now we load. Fifteen minutes since the start time. Goddamn. Is this how I died? Is it? Is it really how I died? Or is it how I thrived? Alright, let's see where we spawn. Ooh. Oh, we got a little backpack. Cute. Where's my baseball bat? There it is. <clears throat> I 
down to their belt for some reason, too. Wait, do I have two bags on? That's... <coughs> what? what? <coughs> Excuse me. I think, uh... It messed up somehow. And gave me multiple weapons and stuff. But you know what? I'm not gonna look a gift horse in the mouth. Grab our supplies that we can. And go from here. Alright. Let's grab a, an empty mug. Oh, we already have water bottles. Never mind. Ham, bro. I'm gonna eat it all. Oh, nom, 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 nom. There we go. We are full of bursting. And we're gaining weight, which is good for right now. So uh, I'll take this pop. Take this milk. You have anything else we're gonna leave for now? Right here, a pen. Perfect. Okay. Any medical supplies? Pipe wrench, I'll need that. That's never been useful. All right. Let's just take this time to sit down and we'll just kind of listen through all this. All right. Easy peasy. So, looking at the map, where are we at? Almost center of the map, huh? I think the place we want to be is like around here ish or take. All right, we got some zombies down that way. I think what we should do is try to loot the uh, trailers around us, then head on to another area. Come here, you. What the? Are you kidding, my guy? How did I mess that up? Very first thing. Tank top, rip it up. Of course, they're fucking dirty. Rip all the clothing we can. <laughs> Alright, then disinfect it. And then wrap it up in ripped sheets. There we go. Let's go ahead and wear things we can here. You little bastards. This works. Oh, come on, y'all. You're killing me here. Literally, you're killing me, actually. It's pretty funny. Who else wants a piece, huh? If not the thread, I want to keep the thread. Ooh, this guy has a dehydrated meat stick. Come to Papa, or I guess Mama in this case.
What else you guys got on you, huh? Any watches? Well, we're not off to a very good start quite yet, are we? This guy has a bunch of fucking gold. Alright. Go ahead and rip our skirt. Of course, it, it stops my movement, I forgot. Well. I hate when they, like, try to sit up, like, immediately. Like, just stay knocked down for a second. What are you doing? Real quick, I just wanna scope out the area. There we go, there's a watch. Denim shirt, better than what I got. There we go, digital watch too. And we got some cigarettes see it. Alright, let's drop the uh, button we do not need. Ooh. Big loot. I guess I'll check the one who's not a fireman first. And we have a gas mask? Oh my gods. Well, we're a fireman now. I guess a firewoman, my bad. Why is there a window in the bathroom on this door? Antidepressants, more cologne, that's great. Painkiller will come in handy. Alright, cool. Uh, while we're here, let's go ahead and fill our stuff up. And I guess let's wash all of our clothing. Cool. Let's search the rest of this stuff. Hey, a screwdriver. There we go. All right, let's see what we got here. Mortar and pestle, huh? Got some more canned goods. Might as well, uh, what is that? Plus negative 100 for thirst, huh? Yep. Might as well drink that. Eat the onion since it's fresh. Ooh, bacon. Ooh, more canned goods. Hell yeah, baby. Right, let's go ahead and replace the bandages. Go with both of them here. Dang, those are really bleeding, huh?
I dang near like died just from changing the freaking bandages. Fitness club, squats, my good apartment. Mm, nothing really in there, huh? Newspaper and stuff. Oh, I was like, why am I panicking? But then I was like, oh yeah. I forgot we uh, hate the sight of blood, so anytime I do my bandages, we get a little startled. Who locks their trailer? It's a trailer, not a house, my guy. Come on. What are they going to steal? Your garbage? Granted, I am stealing their stuff, but... Nothing in this place? Is this like a... A non-used trailer? I want to burn down. I wonder if there's a police... Uh, not police, a uh, fireman here. Nice if we could find a uh, <clears throat> a lighter so we could light up and take care of our anxiety here. Come on, dude. What the fuck was that? I think we're just gonna go back to our trailer. This is uh, not working out for us very well. We're just gonna try to get some blood back and uh, relax for a little while. Oops. Open this. We'll kind of stay well fed so we can attempt to get that free healing increase. There we go, my blood's coming back. I would, uh, attempt to disinfect. That's just not nice. That is just not nice. For those of you who do not know what has happened, that was my schizophrenia. Okay, Nimble might be a little bit, wait, too easy to, like, level up. Just from, uh, I guess the five times and then the extra that's on it now. How much we can do there? Alright, let's, uh, need to sit. Alright. Wait, no, hold on. Replace and disinfect. Okay, never mind. That uh went way worse than I thought it was going to. What else is a lot of calories here? Tuna does. Open that up. Well, not how I was expecting our first day to go. Almost dying. So uh Yeah, 
yeah, we're basically just gonna have to sit here and deal with it. <laughs> you suppose that's schizophrenia? Don't see how there are these doors moving. It'd be nice if we had some skill books or something to read while we were here and not just sit on the ground doing absolutely nothing. I would like to switch those bandages, but when I do, we lose a bunch of health. Do I have something that, like, causes me to... lose a lot more blood or something? No? Well, our first aid's almost up. <sighs> Go ahead and take some happiness pills, shall we? stuffed. Increase that healing. Do it. Alright. Replace the bandage again. That wasn't too bad, right? <laughs> We're basically just wasting our food supplies here. Don't have any more uh, clean rags. Oh, I had like a few of them. I wonder what happened to them all. Let's go ahead and clean them then. I thought I had more than four anyway. Okay. Let's do the one that's not going to kill us immediately. So, what, what do I do first? I remove the bandage. as well. You know what? We might as well exercise while we're here, right? <laughs> I mean, I have to be queasy because of the infection, right? I disinfected that wound, right? Well, we're tired now, at least. Let's take our painkillers and go to bed. When we wake up tomorrow, maybe we can find some more... I don't know. More uh, cologne or disinfectant somewhere. God dang window lickers. Did that also say infected? That neck wound is really bad, y'all. Like, really bad.
go across the street, check this little house out. Finally, a trailer that's not locked. Yes, cologne. All right. That there. Also grab the tweezers and an adhesive band-aid. Get some soap too, why don't we? Let's go ahead and wash ourselves because we're kind of bloody and stuff. All right, there we go. Okay. Jesus. We're going to replace and disinfect this with a, an actual, like, bandage bandage. That's all the cologne I had, too, which is unfortunate. My lady's not having a good time here. But at least we managed to uh, do something about that wound. Hopefully that uh, gets it in a better way. Where did this guy come from? You're not dead, hold on. There you are. Hey, hey, new watch. I don't know why I want this one more than the others, but something about it just speaks to me, you know. We gotta go. We gotta go. Every zombie I kill now is a zombie I don't gotta kill later. Ah, fuck, that was gonna work too. Okay, we are in pain, which is lowering our damage. Let me take some of these happy pills. Where are all these guys coming from? No. None of that. Fuck off. Kindly fuck off. I like how I just knocked those two back on the ground again. First hit. I'm not doing anything here. Um. I'm a nervous fucking rat. Maybe. There might be time to abandon this place. Let's check the map. And then pause the game. Um, There's some stuff up here. We got a community service building and then a, a retail building up there. So let's go uh, up this way. Oh my god. Why are there so many zombies there? Just why? What did I do to deserve this? Like, this is not even urban area at all. Where? Are, why are all these zombies here? This is a trailer park, which should be like 30s. Oh my god. Oh my god! Alright, ladies and gentlemen, well, uh. Got a trailer. And if we can find a semi to pull it with, we will be in business. 
I don't know how these work. If I go around back, can I like open up the back of it? Oh, I guess this is not one that I can actually like use. This all just planks. Yep, okay, we're getting out of here before we uh, run into anyone. Obviously not that. Y'all, I don't think there's... I don't think there's a way out of this. I think we're gonna die. If we didn't have, like, an infection... There's just no way we can get past all these zombies that are just all over. Why? Chat. Folks. People. Friendzos. Where? Where are all these zombies coming from in a trailer park? Huh? Like. They're set to be... In, they're not uniform across the map. They're supposed to be in like urban areas. This is not an urban area in the slightest, y'all. Not at all. Not even remotely. Is the reason it's so much because this is affecting the start population. So technically, we're at three right now. And when we get to here, we're going to be at, what would it be, uh, 4.5? Shit. Maybe I made a mistake with the settings there. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go down this way. At least we're getting skills, I guess. The problem right I could probably take those two. The problem right now is that we do not have the uh well, I probably can't take that whole horde if I can deal with these three. Let's give it a try. Oh what why are you getting up now? I was on top of you. going down this way. If I can kill off a couple of zombies who are down this way, maybe we can get into that van, or maybe we can do something. I don't know. Move the Louisville map. I'll read it in a moment. Okay. Okay. That was a little bit 
more than I was hoping for, but can't really do much with it right now. I don't even know how my wounds got infected. It just doesn't make sense. Really, you're locked. Okay, asshole, fine. Um... locked. Trunk is two. That's a laundromat. That's a food market. We're not gonna find anything in there. This lady wants to say hi, though. Hi, ma'am. find something that I can use to heal myself. Jesus. Maybe I'll stumble upon a zombie that has like antibiotics on them for some reason. I don't know. Look, I have schizophrenia, not PTSD. Why do I keep hearing gunshots? Nothing but soap, are you Help me a little bit with uh stuff. Okay, well, let's check the trailer across the street then. Oh, this is a fancy trailer. They have a, a TV in their bedroom. Ooh. One sec. What do I need to make the uh, bound journal? I need leather, glue, and the empty notebook. Vehicle schematics, doors. Ooh. Alright, so I need to find leather clothing. I need to find leather stuff. Um, leather clothing and what else was it again? <laughs> Glue. Which is probably gonna be impossible. Probably.
Ooh, maybe not. But that shed over there has something in it. Giggles, calm yourself down. <sighs> well, no glue. This looks like the uh, trash location. Maybe I can find something in the trash. Copium. I will replace this bandage. Oh no, it's infected too. Of course it is. I can replace this one too. Yeah, it's still causing me massive hemorrhaging. Okay, I'm gonna carefully walk into here. Hopefully not attract the huge horde of zombies. You come on, open the window. Open it. I'm going to die anyway. Let's climb through. That's where you came from. Too much weight. Um, drop a kitchen knife. I don't need any more denim strips. Don't need. Go ahead and open up these cans of tomato. I'll eat one. Too much pain to sleep. This baseball bat's about to frickin' break, too. Let me try to put that on my, uh, back here. I'll be right there. Calm it down with the schizo stick here. At this point, it's not even. Wait. Red wine? 
you suppose that can be used as a disinfectant? No, we cannot. Oh, come on, man. What's my carrying that I could like get rid of right now? I guess I can eat this. Pop that on the ground. There we go. Now I need to find some uh, disinfecting stuff. Okay, that's not gonna open. Okay. Sleep yet? Nope. Nothing. Of course, the first aid kit with suture needles in it. That's not going to help me at all. Come on, sir, I'll beat you down. Oh, where's the sweet spot on you? Huh? Huh? Oh, jeez. Oh, shit. Just die. Already. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to kill many more zombies. Especially if they're in a group. That's gonna help us at all, though. There's so many zombies out there, guys. All right, before we do anything, let's pop these painkillers. And then we'll sleep. Come on, man, not the metal bar. Okay. <clears throat> Try this again. We will place and disinfect this now. Still nauseous. We need to like chillax. I need I need something to start a fire with, man. Damn. I really should have got the uh Nod that lets you light up at a stove. Why am I even holding the sewing kit? Get it on the ground. I don't. I don't even care. <sighs> well, if miracles work, then perhaps the the nauseousness. Also, let me just...
So I don't know if everyone's infected means that it like the way I think everyone's infected would work is that when you die, you just become a zombie. Not that if you get attacked by a zombie, you get uh, infected or reinfected or whatever the hell, right? Map real quick. Yeah, we're not making any progress at all. All right, lady, let's go. Nothing else. Go out wearing sexy underwear. So, let's try to make our way through this forest, out of the trailer park. Hopefully into a town or something that has something... I don't know. You know, more than anything, so far, I'm just finding schizophrenic to be kind of annoying. Right? It's like the gunfire, the metal bar that dropped from the ground. Or dropped on the ground. It's it's just annoying, right? What do I get at this? Negative 10% strength, carry capacity, healing. 30% Incidents? What does that mean? So since it takes two to three days to die from an infection. What? No way. Uh, great. Might as well replace that while I'm here. can't move while opening cans. Apparently. Oh my gods. Hello, anybody out there? I need some antibiotics or something. Another thing, decreasing my strength. Perfect. I feel like I'm slower. Honestly, I have no idea where I'm going. Why that one? Like, the schizo stuff where it's, like, the zombies banging on a door. Or that one where, like, I saw a zombie and I, like, dropped my baseball bat because of it. But it was just, like, a, an apparition. That was cool. Most of the stuff is just not cool. Well, there's no zombies, at least. Knock on wood. This is like really dense forest country. Oof, we've come to a crossroads. 
So, do we go up that way, which will probably just take us closer to town? We probably go south. If we go south, at least we'll be going in a direction we have not yet traveled in necessarily. I wonder if there's working trains. Like, surely you can mod that in, right? Who knows? Well, it's been an hour. And we're somehow still alive. I'm just hoping that this nauseous goes uh goes away. How many more rags do I have? If the nauseous goes down to queasy, it'll mean we're not like going to turn into a zombie at least. I was gonna check how many more rags we got. Three? Okay. Great, my neck wound is fucking messed up now too. Great. Love to see it. If only I could find some glue, I could just make a journal at least so that I could recover these stats. Not that we worked very hard for them or anything, but Jesus. The thing is, even if we do get to a a city, unless we don't have any zombies in our way, we're going to be screwed. But we've used disinfectant on both of these wounds. But you know what? I might as well replace these just to keep this from getting infected too. place that quick. That still says infected, didn't it? It was a road. The thing is, I don't remember any of the uh, towns that we've been through having a, a railroad going through it. I think if we continue following the road, <clears throat> we'll at least get to uh find something hello fair car can i get inside of you no mm-hmm <laughs> Well, if I could get into it, that would have been, yep, <clears throat> we just got sick. At this point, I don't know. Do we need to get... You know, I'm just going to do this before I forget as well. Um, we're just going to turn that to off. Because again, I don't know if I'm dying because I got <clears throat> transmitted. Or if I'm dying because I just uh, have infections that aren't healing. Either way, we're kind of in a shit spot now. Map. <clears throat> let's go south. Just let's just check to make sure there's nothing like just right out of range here. Oop. Hadn't opened that one yet. There we go. Might as well just keep stuff in our face.
I was really hoping we would snap out of that, like, <clears throat> problem we're having with the uh, things. I mean, we don't need to rebandage our wounds as often, it doesn't seem. But that, that fucking neck wound, I think, is what's killing us. Also, the slow healing ability we took. Yeah, that's not great. When we die, we're just gonna, like, be in the middle of the road somewhere. Never gonna be able to find our body again. <sighs> Woe is us. We've walked so far from that little shitty town. I think the main problem of us being up there was just the simple fact that there were so many zombies compared to like how big the town should be, right? <laughs> there just should not have been that many zombies. We'll take some antidepressants to get rid of that maybe. Go ahead and eat the rest of this uh, hand food here. Go the rate we're going, we basically have to eat in order to stay under the weight that we need to be at. So we can move around without injury. I could just use like a car to sleep in too. If anyone wants to just grant me a car. Hello. Another wreck. I don't think I can sleep in it. Come on, let me in. No, it's wrecked. Let me inside of it. Would have been really cool, y'all, if we could have just, you know, slept in there. Also, would be really cool if we could just, you know, sleep outside. I could just like curl up. It's a trail. Do I see anything on the map around me? No. I think it's just dirt then. I would just like speed up time while we're walking to make us move faster. Because either we're going to find somewhere to, like, survive and get rid of this sickness, <laughs> or we're just going to die. Also, I like how I took these antidepressants that are supposed to remove unhappiness. Um, but they didn't do jack shit, did they? Maybe I just wasn't paying attention. They did, but it came back. There's really nothing around us, is there? Yeah, our depression is not going down at all. If I could just find some, like, landmark or, or something. Like a little cabin in the woods, maybe. That'd be enough. <sighs> I 
Come on, guys. God, there's just so many roads that are just... There's just nothing out there. Ugh. Maybe I should have uh, downloaded some more of the... Uh, whatchamacallum? Settlement or town or village mods or something like that. I think a lot of those are like in like the edges of the map, though, not the centers. How have I not seen one zombie this whole time either, by the way? Like, at this point, just fucking bring it. I'd rather die than walk around in a lost cause forever. Oh, look, there's a, uh, a branching path here. Let's refer to our glorious map. There are structures over here. Some sort of rest station. Oh, let's crouch. We can't really run anyway. All of the trailers parked this way, like the 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 front of it is here. How did the truck driver get it? All right, please be something other than planks. It's all planks. trailer there. <sighs> oh, for fuck's sake. Let me in! Through the fucking window, man. They would ever just kill me. Well, that was, uh, what was her name? Whatever her name was. Um, she died. Rest in peace. At least next time. If we can find this place, we'll have a nice, uh, little, like, a gas trailer out there. Some other stuff we can explore. Man, just imagine if there wouldn't have been a, an alarm there. What would we have done? Might as well go and uh, choose our our next thing. We chose Schizo before with Slow Healer. I think everything here is okay except for the Slow Healer thing. Kind of sucks, to be honest. You know what? Screw it. Slow Reader, give it to me. What else we got here that we can grab
crazy how I can choose both strong and very underweight, isn't it? But we're going to do it. We're going to be very underweight. Because um, we'll just pack on pounds by eating a bunch of food, right? So let's also grab Lucky. And... We have three points left. It's always an odd number, isn't it? Screw it. Gives me asthmatic. No. Not that one. Why don't we get fast healer? That way, we actually uh, stand a chance against some stuff. Okay, so we have two points, so I could either get Outdoorsman or choose a two-point skill to remove here. Like short-sighted or slow leader. Or I could get another uh, bad perk and... Uh... I'm only for three, right? Yeah. Reading books isn't that big of a deal. Let's get that. All right. Next person is... Raymond? You're right. All right, folks, it is nighttime. Again, not sure why we have a school bag. Um, two school bags, anyway. And two belts, but that's just what happens, I guess. All right, folks. We're going to end things here. When we start up next time, we will... Uh, to go from there. I'm curious if we look at the map, actually. Where am I at? Over there. Okay, so we were nowhere near this area. But, uh. I can put a. Well, I could put a marker there, but I think we can remember that. Alright. Until next time, folks. Bye for now.